Today I will introduce how to use hidden clock camera. Firstly, after receiving the parcel, please check the package. Including, one clock hidden camera, one charging cable, one charger adapter, one user manual, one exclusive dust cloth, one pin one finger crowbar, one battery. Note, before first using, we suggest you to charge it for 4 to 6 hours. And recommend you plug in a outlet, then it can work all day 7 24ths. 90% of the problems are caused by insufficient power. Part 1 Reset the camera. Firstly, please use finger crowbar to open the back cover. Then remove the white insulating strip. Then use charging cable or charging adapter to charge it for 3 hours. Before switching it on, please insert a SD card if you want a recording, support up to 6 4 GB. Turn on the camera, flip the switch on wait 20 seconds. Indicator will light up. Then use the reset pin to stab the reset button for about 6 seconds. You can see the screen turns to black and then flashes blue after 15 Which means is complete. Part 2 Pair the device with the app. Firstly, search and download the Tuya Smart on the App Store or Google Play. Then, sign up for an account and use your email address to register. Search your country. Enter the mailbox verification code, and all the request. Click Add Device, then find Security Category. Click the first one, Smart Camera, Wi-Fi. There are two ways to connect, QR Code Connection or Easy Mode Connection. First one, QR Code Connection. Make sure 2.4G Wi-Fi Network, Enter Password. Click Next. Use the device's camera scan the QR code on the phone screen. Make sure the QR code on your mobile device facing the camera lens. Hold 15 to 20 centimeters away until the screen flashes fast. Click I heard a prompt and the pairing is complete. Note, there is no prompt tone, please click next directly after pairing. Time display changes from midnight to the right time matches your mobile. Click Done, Start the Camera Monitoring. Part 3 Basic Functions Introduction Click Screenshot or Record when you want to take pictures or videos. Please note one point. About this recording button on the app, we seldom use it. We mainly record by the SD card. The camera records are automatically saved on the SD card. Click Photo Album and you will find the pictures and videos you have taken. Click Replay to check the record and select the replay date. Click Alarm and you can turn on or turn off motion detection. It can set alarm sensitivity level from high to low according to your needs. When movement is detected, a notification is automatically sent. Click Time Format and you can select 12 or 24 hour as you like. Enter Settings and you can see Night Vision on Auto Mode or Turn On or Off. Turn on the infrared night vision function. You can see the black and white video. Turn off this function, you will see the color video during daytime. We recommend you use auto mode. Then it can change automatically according to the daytime or nighttime. Part 4 Read the contents of the SD card. Remove the SD card from the clock camera and insert it into the card reader. Pay attention to insert direction. Then plug the card reader into the computer's mainframe. You can find the USB driver, and the default folder is the recorded video. The default file name is the record year. Each folder is a different month. Click the September, each folder is the specific date. You can choose which fragment you want to watch. Each fragment is 3 minutes long, which is loop recording. Part 5 How to Open the Audio If you want to record audio, please format the SD card before recording.
We have different audio file version. You switch version file depends on attached version number in clock camera. Copy the audio file into the formatted SD card. Then insert the card into camera, it will record the audio. Turn on the sound button and you can hear the sound on your phone. Note, if the phone is too close to the clock, it will make noise. So please let the phone further away from the clock camera.